found some battle drills there at the end of practice. Do you, do you... Don't read into it. No. It's just, no, we wanted to play a game, just some close ice, uh, just to get some puck touches. A lot of guys didn't go on yesterday. Um, yeah, just to touch the puck in some enclosed areas. We went into this season uh, talking about the depth on your defensive side of it, you know, throughout the whole organization. There was always talk earlier on about how, you know, this guy got, might get moved or that one because you have that depth, but it never happened. Uh, when you look back on it now, probably feel pretty good that, that you didn't move any of those Who was going to be moved? You tell me. There was you had information, I, or are you no, just no, making it, was it up? The, just in general, general, general talking about uh, you know just the depth in the organization, and that's one area that yeah, it, look we've at. had a dip into it. There's no question, and uh, uh, Peeker's come along quicker than we thought, as far as what what we feel he can be, and um, yeah, a lot of people getting opportunities. What did you see in New Navarre that made you want to go with him and Seth, or was it just the way it kind of worked out with the way the rest of the pairings are? Yeah, I, I, I didn't want to break up Savvy and uh, and Gavi, and uh, really wasn't crazy about Harry and Nudie playing together. We we didn't like that pair, so uh, went that way. I'm not sure which way we'll go tomorrow. Have you liked uh, Peak so far in the little small time that yeah, you've got? Yeah, the same just same make simple plays. Uh, I think he needs a better understanding of of zone coverage versus man on man. I think sometimes when young players come up, they lock on to people. Uh, zone coverage is a little bit more thinking involved in it. Uh, uh, but he's he's been a good player. Uh, he's shown us some offensive instincts too that uh, that's coming along. So he's been a good player. And it's a right-handed defenseman. Really important. Gavrikov, he was talking, he was saying how difficult last spring was to step right into this team, into the playoffs. You're not sure what everybody else in the room's thinking about you. Whose job? Who have you pushed out of a job to take? Where do you fit in? Have you been impressed with the way a he handled that situation, but also how he's fit into a room where the only two guys he really did know, Bobrovsky and Panarin, are gone. they're gone. And it's all new to him. Yeah, I, I, like he's been here a long time already. You know, the the definition for him, for me, is he's a hockey player. I think that's the way he acts. I, I think he. Um, there's no frills. Uh, at times he's ugly. Uh, at times, it, 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 but I, I just think he finds a way to be effective all the time. Uh, that's what I appreciate about him. Uh, is I think he's very, uh, he's very dependable, uh, and, and he's just always there. He, it, it, he, he gets his tentacles on on people. It's tough to get away from him defensively. If he if he has a bead on you. Uh, closing you out, it's tough to get away from him. So he just, th that's the best thing I can say about him. I just think he enjoys playing, uh, and he's just a hockey player. There's no be bullshit with him. He just plays. Can you take time for a defenseman to earn trust with the coach? Did you come to trust him pretty quickly? Yeah, I, I was I was concerned, uh, not concerned. I, I, I need to see him play. Uh, I, I wanted to see his puck skills. Uh, uh, and as, I, as, as you keep on watching, uh, very underrated as far as his puck skills. And uh, the thing that has surprised me, I think he reads the ice very well. And I think I've said this to you before, as far as when to jump in offensively too. He's around areas that you just look up and say, this Gaffey, he has another chance. And yes, yeah, so he's very smart that way. He, he that's, a, that's a good hockey player. That's the way I'll, I'll define him. Dave King was saying he always thought he would fare better on the smaller rink than he did the bigger rink because he's... He gets his tentacles. He's like an octopus. If he gets you, it's tough to get away from him. And he's all arms and he and, he, and he's strong and he, he, he's ugly as sin at times, but it, huh. he doesn't get beat. And uh, yeah, it, it is a... That's a huge... That's just, it's a huge piece of the puzzle for us this year. Do you remember that dinner you had? Yes, I do. With him and yeah. it was how awkward that was when the news. Yeah, I I don't like those dinners anyway. Quite honestly, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not a big, I'm not a good recruiter. Um, but yeah, I remember sitting there and I, and I believe is he he's, was it his girlfriend or was he married at that time? Is he married? He's married now. Yeah, I'm not sure if he was. Married, but yeah, we I think we went to Hyde Park and I was a spectator, you know, and just kind of watched and uh, yeah gets a free dinner and stays over there in place. So he owes us a dinner. <laughs>
Yeah, he's paying. He's paid us well. He's paid us well. <laughs> John, how is being in this mode of next man up, the next man up mentality? How's that helped now through this latest loss? I mean, a lot of teams, if they would suffer a loss to this magnitude, this point in the season, like, oh, geez, but this team is. We don't even say next man up. Yeah. We, we don't even talk about it. We just play. Um, yeah. So we, uh, uh, foods will come back in uh, from London. He's going to play tomorrow and. Uh, we, we don't talk uh, those cliches, next man up, this, we go play. And whoever's on the board, I, I, first thing in the morning I come in, I put the lineup on the board, that's who's playing. That's how we go about our business. And that's become commonplace here. So doesn't that make it naturally easier to accept if another guy would happen to go down? Yeah, we, we, again, we, we've, never we've never, if there's an injury, it, it's a, there's an out, I have an out with a line underneath it, and I'll put that player out. And that to the right of that is going to be the lineup. We've always gone about it that way, and uh, we'll continue to do it that way.